next. He's got some speed. Burning his way up over the blue line. Van Dees to the front of the net. There It was a good night to be a Portage Terrier at the PCU Center. Bryce Lipinski scored a hat trick as the dogs down Verdon 7-2. The Grand Prairie native talks about his recent hot streak. I think I've just been getting to the areas now, thinking about it as much as I was at the start of the year. And yeah, just being in the right spots and bearing when I have my chances, and that's been really a difference. Hey, to the middle, finds his man, Walmo with his shot stop. <laughs> Last night's game also saw the first goal of the season for local product Riley Hay. After playing more than 20 games without a goal, Hay talks about getting the monkey off his back. Uh, I think it was Van Dees gave me a nice pass and uh, sent me and Zach on kind of a Zach Wall goal on a two on two. And uh, I realized Zach had lots of speed coming in, so I just dished him the puck when I had the chance. And he, he burnt the D man and tried to put her five hole and uh, the goalie goalie got his shot and I just came and picked up the garbage and put her in so it was nice to get that first goal out of the way. Next up for the Terriers is a meeting with the Pistons on Saturday at the PCU Center. Defenseman Clay Van Deest says what the team needs to do to be successful. Well, I think we just got to have a good week of practice and uh, just stay positive and keep everyone healthy. We got to get everyone back in the lineup and just keep going and uh, build off this momentum. The Terriers and Pistons lock horns Saturday night at the PCU Center. For Golden West Broadcasting, I'm Jeff Dick.